Hey guys and welcome back to another video. In today's video I have another challenge for you, which is the City Football Group Challenge. I will give you some background information about the company, their football clubs and rules you can apply to your career mode save. If you go on and enjoy the video, be sure to give it a like and subscribe to my channel to not miss any other career mode challenges. Now let's get into the video. The City Football Group is a holding company, which means they buy and own the shares of companies, which it then controls. They are quite known in the footballing world nowadays as they own multiple football clubs, with Manchester City being considered the group's flagship. The City Football Group also owns stakes in clubs from the United States, Australia, India, Japan, Spain, Uruguay, China, Belgium and France. In 2008, Manchester City got taken over by the Abu Dhabi United Group. Since the takeover, Man City have won multiple trophies, including four Premier League titles. Other clubs that are owned by the City Football Group and are in FIFA 21 are Girona from Spain, who are currently competing in the Segunda División, Troyes from France, who are playing in Ligue 2, Melbourne City from Australia, New York City from the United States, and Yokohama Marinos from Japan. Teams that are also owned but not in FIFA are Lommel from Belgium, Montevideo City Torque from Uruguay, Mumbai City from India, Sichuan Jiu Niu from China and Club Bolivar from Bolivia. In this career mode challenge you firstly have to pick a club you want to start the save with. You can choose either Girona, Troyes, Melbourne City, New York City or Yokohama Marinos, so not Manchester City. Your goal will be to win the best competition possible with your chosen club and dominate their country. So if you choose Girona or Troyes, you will have to win the Champions League, but also get multiple titles in either Spain or France. During the challenge, most of your transfers have to be from other city football group clubs. So if you decide to start with Girona, you will have to sign most transfers from Manchester City, Troyes, Melbourne City, New York City and Yokohama Marinos. When it comes to buying these players, most of your deals have to be swap deals because this way most of the players stay within the City Football Group network and if they turn out to become great players, the entire network will profit from it as it will grow the City Football Group company and so also the clubs. Instead of signing players who aren't in the City Football Group, you can also buy a few former players from these clubs and bring them back into the City Football Group network. Examples are Douglas Luiz, Pablo Mafio, Kelashi Iannaccio, Angelino and Takafusa Kubo. When it comes to selling players, you will have to accept every transfer or loan offer from a different City Football Group team. So if Manchester City wants to buy one of your players, you have to immediately accept the deal. In terms of the Youth Academy, I would recommend to use all three Youth Academy scouts and send them to countries of City Football Group clubs that are on FIFA 21, which is Belgium, Uruguay, China and Bolivia. India is not available as an option unfortunately, but if you still wish to make them part of the challenge, I would suggest to buy either one or two Indian players and have them in your squad. At the end of the challenge, your team should be filled with some incredible players, with the starting eleven mostly consisting of current club players, players from other city football group clubs, youth academy stars from the countries I just mentioned, and possibly a few Indian players as well. With dynamic potential, you can get any player to a very high rating, so make sure you sign players that fit well into your team and tactics, instead of solely looking at the potentials of players. So let me know in the comments with which team you will try this challenge. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to give it a like and subscribe to my channel to not miss any other career mode challenges, and I will see you at the next video.